what's up guys? Today we're gonna to be relacing a one-piece full web. This is the same pattern as the standard basket web and other webs that we offer. Let's get right into it. All right, to start guys, um, you're gonna notice that your one-piece full web here will have a bunch of little leather eyelids that we need to line up with the glove, okay? Uh, so that's what you'll first wanna do. And then we're gonna take our lace. And again, we're gonna remember that we have a smooth side and a rough side. And we're gonna want the smooth side to present itself here in the palm. And then the rough side to present itself through these little leather, uh, leather eyelids, okay? So to start relacing this one piece full web, we're gonna work our way to the finger side of the glove through the top and back down the thumb, okay? We're gonna to wanna to start with the rough side uh, facing up. We're gonna go through this first hole here and we're not gonna to go to the palm side yet. That's how we'll finish. To start though, we're just gonna go underneath this little leather section right here. Okay, smooth, I'm sorry, rough side up through this little leather section just on the top. Just pull it straight through. Okay, and we're gonna leave about three, four inches of excess lace right here for our knot at the end, okay? Now that we've got that through, we're going to put the web on. You're going to go through that first leather eyelid. Okay. So now we're set up with the rough side up. And now when we go to the palm side, we'll have that smooth side facing. All right, now that we've gone through that first leather section here in the first leather eyelid, we're gonna follow this pattern all the way up to the top, okay? Now, when we go through this next hole, we are gonna work our way to the palm side here, okay? So you go straight through. Make sure your lace doesn't get twisted. Again, rough side up on the back finger and then smooth side up on the palm side. Rough side, palm, uh, smooth side here. Okay, we're just gonna go straight through the palm to the back side. Okay, pull that nice and snug, not too tight. Just make sure that lace lays nice and flat, just like that. Okay, and we're just gonna repeat that same pattern we just did here all the way up to the top. All right, guys, now that we've worked our way to the top of the index finger here, we're now gonna have to run the lace through the top portion of the web. So we'll go through that last hole at the top. Come out. Okay, and then we want the smooth side of the lace to run through on the back, just like that. You can see that this is facing the wrong way, so we're just gonna give it a quarter turn inward, just like that, and now we're set up to run a smooth side on the back through the top. So once we've gotten through the top portion of the web there, we're now gonna work our way down the thumb here, just like we went up the finger side. So you go back into the thumb, top hole of the thumb, Come out palm side. We're just gonna connect all those little leather eyelids onto the glove, just like that. Make sure that your smooth side is being presented here on the palm side of the glove. So give that a quarter turn there.
Okay, and then rough side through the eyelids here. And then all the way down. Okay, when you get to this section here, this is the, the box knot from the palm lace. You're gonna go in that same hole and out through the palm here. Just like that. Okay, we're here on our last eyelid and we're gonna be finishing it up with another tail end to tie our knot. As we go through here, we'll finish it up like we did the rest of those. And now when we enter where we first began, we're gonna go in that same hole that we started in. But instead of going underneath on this top layer right here, we're now gonna go into the palm side right inside here. All right, so in the same hole we started. And then straight out the palm. Okay, pull that through. Okay, now to finish up, got one hole to go through. We're gonna go the other side at the bottom of that web. All right, as you go through the palm side here into the back finger of the glove, you already have a lace running through on the left side. What you wanna do is kind of work your way to the left and up on that last hole, just so you can get a good tying point for that, for that knot. Again, just give these laces kind of a press down inside the palm there. Okay, then you'll match the excess for the tail in there, and you'll tie your knot. So you can see how we have the smooth side facing right, uh, rough side facing left here. We need to get these oriented the same way. So we're gonna give this a quarter turn here. Smooth side showing there. Give this a quarter turn here. Now we've got both smooth. Okay, tie the knot again. We're gonna go left over and under the right. Pull down. This left lace now we're gonna do a quarter turn up, pull up. You'll have your first smooth knot in this double knot. You have rough side showing here and here. We'll take the bottom lace over and under the top lace. Give this a quarter turn here to show smooth and then pull left and right. And then cinch your knot down. And there you have it. You have your one full piece closed web. All right, guys, now that we have the web laced on, we're going to lace up the fingers and the top of the web. To learn how to do that, check out this video here.
All right, guys, and that's how you release a one-piece full web.